Four-month selection will begin on 27th November for a period of two weeks. Right, uh, Michael Warutere is the top student in the country and he garnered 428 marks. He's from Riara Springs. Um, our reporter, Beldin Waleola, spoke to him earlier on and this is what he had to say. So we are coming live from Riara group of schools where they have the top scorer when it comes to KCP for this year. And I have here Michael Rutere who has scored 428 marks. Yes, for this year's KCP. And maybe just tell us how are you feeling first of all today? Uh, I feel, I feel uh, I'm very happy for what uh, God has helped me to achieve today. Yes. Mm -hmm. And give us uh, your routine maybe. What were you planning? Did you plan to score such high marks? Uh, to, to be honest, I surprised myself in the exams. I was hoping for at least 410, but uh, I, 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 I exceeded expectations. Mm -hmm. Yes. How was your study schedule like? I have to revise, you have to do, or I have to tackle all the subjects equally because you know, there are some sub subjects which have less marks. People usually don't, uh, they, they ignore them, but you have to study all of them equally. And also, you also have to exercise and relax your mind. So when you actually do study, you have a, a fresh mind to take all the information properly. Yeah. What is the biggest motivation? Uh, I just say the self-drive I had and the belief in yourself. Because that, that can do wonders if you believe in yourself. Yeah. And which school are you aiming at and uh, in future what do you want to pursue? Uh, I want to be a student of Mangu High and later on in life uh, probably I want to be a software engineer. Yes. And uh, maybe uh, as you go, do you think what uh, what have you learned from Yara here that will uh, propel you even when you go to high school that you think will uh, enable you to achieve even better? What Yara has taught me is uh, you have to be consistent and self-determined. Don't give up halfway and expect results because you have to push, push, push. So like uh, you can later on you can report you report it. So you can't do anything halfway. You have to do full full board. Yes. And uh, Michael is joined by his family here today, and I believe you're the dad. Maybe can you introduce yourself to us? Yeah, my name is Samuel Muturi. I'm the dad to Michael. Proud dad, and, uh, and, and really, really quite excited and quite uh, speechless mm -hmm. on, this, on this nice and uh, surprise that we got today. So, uh, is he your firstborn? He is our firstborn. Mm -hmm. And uh, so, so we, 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 we were looking forward as, and also the first one to do a, a major candidate exam. So we're really excited that uh, he's achieved it. Uh, it's the last 844. So also it's a big milestone and also he will be in history to some extent. You think he has given a good start for the rest? Uh, I, thi I think he, he, has, he, has, uh, he has set up the path for them. Uh, we, we raise them to be independent children. Uh, but also, they need to drive themselves and to do. But really, really, is can't be. A, they can't get a better example. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and apart from paying school fees and playing your role as a dad, what was one thing that you maybe used to remind him when he wakes up in the morning to go to school and maybe during the exam period? Just fo just focus, stay calm, and uh, yeah, you you've been you've been. It's eight years, so. You will, you, you're ready. Uh, he just needed to know I've got his back. Mm -hmm. That's what I told him. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. And I'm sure a mom, uh, proud mom too today. <laughs> Did you give him pressure? I uh, know we, we let him choose his time, his study time and, and plan his, his time. So we are very proud that, you know, the self-drive has worked and, and definitely a lot of prayers that, you know, went into this. We're also grateful to the school. They, they asked us to give, you know, the children time. Um, there was a lot of motivation, you know, from parents, school teachers. Yes. And maybe uh, to the rest also now, I think they also have pressure. Yes, they do. They're all here in Riara, um, all the way from kindergarten. And, and we're looking forward to their success as well. Yes. And if one thing that uh, you look at your son and you think maybe what is still the self-drive in him and maybe the discipline to achieve uh, what he has achieved today? So it's the way we, you know, we are as a family, uh, definitely, and the, the community we live in and, and the school, uh, you know, the school motto, the school character has built that also uh, around self-drive. And then they have a lot of, you know, support from teachers uh, to support students in, in being confident. But we are happy as a family that that has also, our work has also played, uh, you know, a part in, in his confidence here. Thank I know he has his own ambitions and maybe you as a mother, what do you wish your son could be? So uh, we've learned not to push, you know, careers on our children, 
I really would support him in you know the career he would like. Uh, right now he's looking at software engineering, and and that's something that we really look forward to supporting him. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. So allow me to talk to the head teacher too. Uh, the teacher of the uh, group of schools is also here. You have the top scorer uh, f uh, in the country today. How do you feel, first of all? Wow, it feels great. You feel out of this world. Mm -hmm. Yes. And uh, maybe, uh, first of all, tell us how were you planning, uh, maybe teaching these students to ensure they perform better, and how is the performance across board? Uh, as a school, we've been doing very well every year. If you check at our result, for our results for the last six years, we range around 75%, which is around 375 and above. Uh, but this year being the last one, we engaged an extra gear because we want to end at, to end at the highest. And God granted our prayer. We ended at the highest. And that is the best we would have done with uh, 844, that we ended at the highest and nobody will have an opportunity to challenge our record. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How many students have fallen above? We have 29 of them who have over 400. Majority of the others are between 350 and 399. Mm -hmm. Yes. The best performance so far? Uh, the best performance, uh, I've not done the analysis, just at face value. Uh, the top candidate is 428, the second one is 416, we have a good number of 414, so children have, uh, are each child has achieved their best potential, that's how I would, I would put it. Mm -hmm. yes. What was the motto towards uh, these uh, exams as we end for K uh, KCP, the last uh, round? It was gra grad march to victory, that was our Clarion, Clarion call from January to now. Mm -hmm. and through to it, we've marched to victory and we bless the Lord. We are so humbled. Thank you so much. Uh, the clarion call was grand march to victory and I'm uh, sure uh, they have achieved the victory that they were looking for by getting the top scorer in the country with 428 marks. Uh, Michael Rotere is a happy boy and he's hoping to join Mango High School. Back to you in studio. Right. Thank you, Baldin. Of course, congratulations to Michael Warutere. He is the top student in the country with 428.